the Black Lives Matter movement is responsible for another murder. While in uniform and pumping gas into his squad car at a Houston gas station at around 8.30 Friday night, Harris County Sheriff's Deputy Darren Goforth was shot in the head execution style and several more times while on the ground, allegedly by career criminal Shannon J. Miles who is now in custody and facing capital murder charges. Harris County Sheriff Ron Hickman provided some details of this brutal assassination. The district attorney's office has accepted capital murder charges on Shannon J. Miles. As far as we know, Deputy Goforth had no previous contact with the suspect, and it appears on, at the outset to be clearly unprovoked. He was a target because he wore a uniform. We found no other motive or indi indication that it was anything other than that. Security cameras at the gas station recorded the perpetrator sneaking up on the deputy before cowardly shooting him from behind. Deputy Goforth, a 10-year veteran of the force, leaves behind a wife and two young children. Our prayers here at the Ray Warner Show go out for the family and loved ones of this officer. The local community is mourning the loss and has responded with donations and a makeshift memorial where the murder took place. Local officials are also responding. Harris County District Attorney Devin Anderson joined Sheriff Rickman at the press conference and called out the foolishness of the Black Lives Matter movement and condemned the war on police, asking that Americans all over the country stand up for our law enforcement heroes. The vast majority of officers are there because they care about their community and want to make it a safer place. It is time to come forward and support law enforcement and condemn this atrocious act. There has been no denouncement of the murder by anyone from Black Lives Matter. President Obama has also been silent. The rhetoric and violence is out of control. The no justice, no peace chant from Ferguson has now spread to the whole country. I would ask how many more of our law enforcement heroes need to be murdered before this administration will take this seriously. But as we all know, this is Obama's race war. Hatred and division will be the real legacy of his presidency. Thanks for listening. Help us fight for conservative values. Subscribe and donate at the Ray Warner Show dot com.